Hi friends, welcome to my channel. My name is Mary Grace and we're going to Vegas, baby. I am so excited. We are back with more Percy Jackson and the Olympians. We are on episode six of season one. Even though we're not gonna be getting our poker face montage in the Lotus Casino because Rick Riordan said, what, I'm sorry, that never happened. Normalized bad movie erasure. <laughs> But I'm so excited to see where we go from here. Last episode had the most differences so far, I think. We had the whole, like, Grover and Aries kind of, like, interaction where Grover was, like, big-braining the god of war, which, like, okay, realistically, how would that work, babe? <laughs> He's literally the god of war. Do you not think he can't see what you're trying to do? If it was Athena, I would say absolutely not. That would never work. Aries, okay, maybe. Like, play into the ego, play play it up a little bit. Which he did. I do believe that this episode we are going to get our first glimpses of Lin-Manuel Miranda as Hermes. A few episodes ago, I did mention that Hermes is my favorite god in the books. Um, my... My AirPods are literally named George and Martha after the snakes on his caduceus. So um, I'm very excited to see how he portrays Hermes. I'm nervous because I love Hermes so much as a character in this series. Uh, so I don't know. I need to get out of my head of like the Lin-Manuel Miranda of it all. Because he's just, he's just got such a distinct voice that I, it's my own fault. Because I watched way too much Hamilton during quarantine. And now I can't unhear his voice. Like, it's just, it's just there. It's just there, you know? So I'm going in open. This episode's only 34 minutes. I need longer episodes. I don't know why they're only giving us like half hour long episodes. Like, what was the- I plunged to my death was also only 34 minutes. Like, I need longer episodes. Give me more. I want more. Like, you have this season-long format. Give us more. I want more. <laughs> but we are going to jump right in to season one, episode six of Percy Jackson and the Olympians called We Take a Zebra to Vegas. Do you think you're special, Lightning Thief? Do you think you cannot be replaced? Who are you? The tools to steal the master both only to watch it take him from you. The war ahead of us. The war beyond Zeus and Poseidon's war. Oh. I thought he was talking to Percy. I need to take your place. Oh. Isn't that right, little? Oh, this is a weird interpretation. Not time for us to meet quite yet. Run along now and show me what you are capable of. Huh. Interesting. <gasps> Iris! Oh, I got a signal. Toss a CV brain. Oh my god, we got our first CV brain last time. Oh, Iris. Goddess of the rainbow. Please accept my offering. We love Iris. The gayest of all gods. <laughs> Look. Annabeth? Annabeth? Percy, are you okay? Yeah, we're, we're fine. Where's Chiron? Chiron's holding camp together with both hands. Everyone thinks we're going to war, so the cabins are taking... <laughs> Yikes! No, who stole the bolt? How do you know? We ran into Ares and Grover got him talking and realized Ares knew who the thief was, but was covering for them. So who would Ares cover for other than? His favorite daughter. Clarice is the lightning thief. Tyron's gotta arrest her. Find out what she knows. There's... They're jumping at conclusions. So how do we know which hotel is the Lotus? I'm guessing the one with the giant Lotus Blossom on it. You were like two seconds ahead of me, seriously. Sometimes it might be okay to just let the easy ones go. Can we agree to just try? Ooh, it's got a roller coaster! I know we're supposed to be saving the world, but 
Would it be unprofessional if we just hung out here for a bit? Yes. Your mom told you all the stories. Did she read you the Odyssey? Odysseus lands on a beach. There's these guys who've forgotten where they came from, forgot everything that was important to them. And they got that way because they ate the lotus flowers. If we go in there and then forget everything, that would be bad. They know too much. They need to be a little dumber. <laughs> you think, wise girl? Just don't eat anything. Wait, why were you looking at me when you said <laughs> Go check that side of the floor. I'll take Percy this way. One way or the other, we meet back in the lobby in 20 I don't think splitting up is a good idea. What are you going to say to Hermes at Grover Camp? I was with Luke for a long time before I go. Ah. I saw stuff Grover didn't get to see, like meeting his mom. <gasps> oh. She's a seer. A human who can see through the mist. Sometimes I see stuff that messes them up. Ooh, we're getting background. Okay. I think it happened to her. And Luke blames Hermes for it. And I think Hermes would do anything to win him back. Maybe helping us as a start. Damn, we're getting background. I've been having these dreams. For a while, they were weird. Then, like Luke's mom, they got scary. You have these two, right? Of course. And then this guy started showing up and talking to me. But not like in a regular dream. It's more like he knows we're in a dream. Yeah, that's not good. I somehow ended up in his mm -hmm. dream. Like mm -hmm. I was eavesdropping on him talking to the lightning thief. To the person who stole the master bolt for him. Part I don't get though is that they were talking about what comes next. Like getting Zeus and Poseidon to fight was only the beginning. And they're planning something bigger on top of it. Something the gods don't even know about. I mean, what are we supposed to do about that? Very good question. I don't know. You don't know? There are things I don't know. <laughs> yeah, but if you don't know, I mean, what chances do I have? Very good question. Again. I gotta tell my... I gotta... Wait, I was here with... Oh, it's the deeper in you go. You're here with me. Oh no, it's the deeper in you go. The more you forget. That's so bad. Big wave comes and washes the boy back onto the beach. There he is. There's our guy. He says, he was wearing a hat. <laughs> <laughs> hey, demigods, welcome. We need your help to. I know what you need my help for. You want my help to sneak into the underworld. Wow. You're a really good guesser. <laughs> You're not the first demigods to ask. And trust me, you won't be the first demigods to walk away disappointed. So you might as well at least play a little bit. We're friends of Luke's. Mm -hmm. Said the magic word. Okay. Time and space are easy, kids. Parenting is something else entirely. Have a seat. All right, I'm liking it so far. You were there. Last time I saw Luke. Mm -hmm. Yes. I saw you argue. I heard what he said. That what happened to his mom was your fault. That it was all your fault. That he hated you. Damn, you're just bringing up all of the all the wounds. Help us retrieve Zeus's master bolt from Hades and he'll see that you care. I don't think he will. I was warned to stay away from Luke and his mother. Warned that no matter how much I tried warned to help, by who? it would just make things worse. And I went anyway, and it wasn't just awful for Luke. It was awful for all of us. Do you know what that feels like? Yeah. To be so close to someone you love, knowing neither of you has any choice but to keep hurting each other. That seems to be like every relationship in this universe. I know you do. <gasps> I'm sorry, what did we just experience? Whoa. Should I remind you too? She said, no, I'm good. What was that memory? Are you going to help us or not? I don't get involved anymore. <clears throat> it's just not worth it. I'm sorry. Ooh, I can't wait to see his character growth and his change. I'm actually going to really enjoy this, I think. Percy, why are you sitting there? Go after her. 
She's right to be angry. It isn't fair. None of it is. Thanks. That's super helpful. <laughs> it was your father who warned me to stay away. He said it was awful watching you struggle and feel powerless to stop. Mm. But that sometimes that's what parenting is. That's not helpful either. I was supposed to see him. He said he'd meet me in Santa Monica. Why would he say that if he thinks it'll make things worse? It is very hard for a god to feel powerless. I guess we're all just doing the best we can. Ain't that the truth? If it makes you feel any better, it won't be much use now anyway. What do you mean? What's that supposed to mean? What does that mean? You can't just look at your watch. How long has it been? I know it seems like we've only been here for like 20 minutes, but it's already Thursday. We've been here for days. Where is Grover? Hermes let us sit at that table the whole time, knowing the clock is running out on our quest. <clears throat> yes. And I feel a lot better about having stolen his keys. <laughs> yes, Annabeth! Got invisible in <gasps> his pocket. You picked Hermes' pocket? I'm not talented. <laughs> she stole from the God of Thieves? Iconic. Grover? Grover. Take the VR headset off of him. I was so close. <laughs> I know, I hate it when someone does that to me. And I can't believe I'm the one saying this, but it's really time to go. Where are we going? You don't know who we are, do you? Yeah. No, I don't. Have we met? Take him outside, maybe he'll remember. Grover, we're on a quest. We can't do this without you. We're short on time and we gotta go, right now. A quest? That sounds amazing. Is it dangerous? It's not a deal breaker. I'm just curious. Also, I'm sorry, what was your name again? Get his jacket and bring that boy's ass outside. Okay. God of Travelers. What kind of car does the God of Travelers? All of them? Guys, I gotta say, so far, this quest is really exciting. <sighs> really hoping we find that car. Oh. Finding the car isn't the quest. <laughs> There's more? God, I really hope he steps out of this. Although I hope that game you were playing was amazing. I was hunting for Pan. Sounds great. No, I, I mean, like I actually felt I was about to find mm. her, that, that I'd be the first, that I'd help save the natural world. It just felt so real. That's what we need now more than ever. Hermes drives a cab and left us a note. How do we know that's for us? <laughs> to the dumb kids. <laughs> Should've known the God of Thieves noticed his pocket. Yeah, back. exactly. Back door to the underworld, magic word, map in a glove box. And it says we'll become travelers once we're on the road. And then a the car will take us wherever we wish to go. So, one of us just has to drive it out of the garage. Who knows how to drive? Two of you are 12, and one of you has goat legs. How hard could this be? <laughs> My fault. <laughs> I'm sorry, this is too good. Oh no. You're doing great. I love that the action we're getting is them trying to drive out of a parking garage. <laughs> you just gotta get it onto the street and then the car will drive. This is a real life nightmare. <laughs> Not good. They've gotten in more car accidents in one season. Oh, they're at the beach. Kersey, Annabeth, wait, you. Are they in California? You guys are my Hey, Grover remembers. A little weird that I forgot a lot more stuff than you guys did. I wonder what that's about. You were alone, that's why. That's why splitting up is not a good idea. I think I gotta go meet my dad now. Good luck. Ooh. Hello. Ah, another Nereid. Sorry. He waited as long as he could. Oh. The summer solstice passed earlier this evening. Wait. Zeus's deadline has elapsed. 
Your father has gone to marshal his forces. Wait, what? This is not your fault. You were brave. You were strong. You made your father proud. I'm so confused. It's time for you to return to No, me. no, 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 no. No. Yeah, exactly. I am impertinent. I'm going to see this through. Exactly. You released from your No. Quest. I don't care. I'm not releasing myself from the quest. The war is only the beginning of Hades' plan. There is something else coming. Something worse. Something the gods don't even know about. I have to stop him. I have to keep going. If you can help, then you must help. There is so much of him in you. We all see it. What belongs to the sea can always return. Each will provide one of you safe passage back from the under- Why are there four? Save the world. And then go save your mother. I love that, but I'm so- wait, I'm so confused. Why- why do that? Why do that to us? Why? Why do that? Why do that to us? <sighs> That's cold. <laughs> I mean, I love that she's like, here's four, go save your mom. Save the world, save your mom. What is the point of making it past the sol solstice? The, I feel, where do we go from here then? That makes me think that things are gonna go way differently in the underworld than I was expecting. If it's past the solstice and they're preparing for war, like, First of all, I feel like they should have been preparing for a war beforehand because Zeus was like, if it's not returned by the end of the solstice, then, like, we're going to war. So wouldn't the war have started already? Because this was all to prevent the war, I will say. It was not the Hamilton voice. The Hamilton voice didn't come through. And I'm very happy about that. I'm very excited to see. I liked I liked his performance as Hermes. I I really did. I enjoyed it a lot. I'm excited to see. I'm kind of annoyed that we got so much background on his situation with Luke because I like that that comes up later on in the series. But I'm very excited to see Hermes's progression throughout the series. Like Hermes is the only god that we interact with in the books enough time uh, enough times to see like a character development and like an arc and like a progression between um like who he is the first time we meet him and who he is at the end of the season uh, at the end of the series rather. So I'm very excited to see what they do with that and where they go with that because that's one of my favorite like parts of his character. So I'm really excited now that we've actually like seen him as like seen Lin, Lin Manuel Miranda as Hermes. I'm very excited to see like where it goes from here. We only have two episodes left. Make sure you subscribe and stick around for the last two episodes of Percy Jackson and the Olympians season one. I'm nervous. I'm excited. I'm confused. I'm feeling all of the things. Oh my gods. What's gonna happen? I don't know. Um, <laughs> thank you guys so much for watching and hanging out with me while I watched episode six of Percy Jackson and the Olympians. I hope you guys had a good time. I had a good time. I will leave all of the previous episodes uh, reactions linked in the description as well as all my social medias if you want to follow me outside of here. And yeah, that's all for today. I hope you all have a wonderful day wherever you are. And I will see you all next time for more Percy Jackson. Bye.